This is SAT test 7, calculator question number 36. College Board is asking us about this triangle with a similar triangle drawn inside it. In the figure above, they tell us that the tangent of angle B is 3 over 4. If BC is 15 and DA is 4, What is the length of DE? Since the tangent of angle B is 3 over 4, side AC I'm going to call 3x, and side AB I'm going to call 4x. And if I have a right triangle with the sides in ratio 3 to 4, so the hypotenuse will be 5x. Since 5x equals 15, divide by 5, x equals 3, so 3x equals 3 times 3 equals 9, 4x equals 4 times 3 equals 12. So AB is 12, AD is 4, so BD is 8. And we're looking for side DE in this smaller triangle. This smaller triangle also has sides of ratio 3 to 4, so if 8 is, I'm going to call it 4y, then side DE is going to be 3Y because the ratio of DE over BD is 3 over 4 from the tangent of angle B. Remember, tangent is the opposite side over the adjacent side where we're excluding the hypotenuse from that ratio and just taking the two shorter legs. So they're in the ratio 3Y to 4Y, where 4Y equals 8 divide by 4, y equals 2, so 3y equals 3 times 2 equals 6, and they're asking for de, which I just found is length 6. You will typically need to know the sine or cosine or tangent of an angle for one question on your SAT. Remember that the sine is the opposite side over the hypotenuse. The cosine of angle B would be the adjacent side over the hypotenuse and the tangent is the opposite side over the adjacent side. Come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.